Okay, I think we're back. We're back! It's actually recording this time. I don't know why I've been having problems with my record button. I don't know if it's the new keyboard or what. Yeah, I kind of need the Tesla rifle for ghouls. Makes life a little easier. What with the area of effect. What in God's name am I looking for here again? Is this where I'm killing ghouls? Or is this power tools? Something else. No shit, Nick. Good looking out, buddy. Oh, that's no good. You're unfortunate. Okay, any day now. There we go. Yeah, the hell with that thing. Not that it's an op. Tannery key, huh? Oh, what are you? Oh, the power tools. Lovely. And a bunch of uh, boss chest stuff. I wonder if I have any. Hey! Great mentats I didn't have to make. So is this just the way out? That's just the way out. That was a short little dungeon. I'm all for those. It's not like freaking Oblivion where you're wandering around all afternoon. What the hell are you? Don't fucking run up on me like that. Hey. Hold up! I've been casing those ghouls for weeks. Waiting for an opening. And you dive in and choppy chop, bang, bang, and the whole lot of them dead. You even know what you got right there? A premium set of Roman's power tools. Okay. Hate us again. What about it? Are you gonna start over? Hey. Yeah, I've been start. casing those uh -huh. ghouls for weeks, and you dive in. You even know what you got right? Uh. Yep, With sure. The shape of the world right now, tools like this are useful. Exactly. You got it. Wait. Oh, Mariner sent you, didn't she? Goddamn Mitch and his big mouth. What? No matter what she's offering, it's nothing. Serious builders would give an arm for them tools. I'll pay you two thousand caps right here, right now. The caps Deal? are caps are meaningless to me. Why do you need the tools so much? I got my own special projects. For the caps I'm paying, that's all you need to know. Well, yeah, but I got here first because I'm not a bitch. I'll pass on the offer. I ain't hanging around forever. Walk away from this, and you'll regret it. Okay. Well, as long as I don't have to murder you. Hey. Go ahead. Uh, hey, yeah, Valentine. We've already talked about the thing, right? No, no, this is a new one. Boy, he really hated when I killed that dog merchant. <laughs> uh, are you upset? Matter? You sound upset. <clears throat> what? Oh, no, no. We've just been traveling for a while now, and I figured, especially after all that stuff with Dima, that you deserve to know more about me. Hey! So, is there anything you want to know? I'm sure. Uh, what's up with the detective thing? What's with the outfit? After I started the agency, it just seemed like the sort of thing a detective ought to wear. I got some <coughs> old memories, pre-war. Faded to all heck of guys dressed like this, doing what I do. Putting on the hat and trench coat, I figured it let folks know I was serious about the whole thing. Clothes make the man and all that. Guess I felt they made me the man I wanted to be. And who are you? So, so who are you, Nick? That's a question I've been trying to figure out myself for a long damn time. I know I'm a synth, authentic institute handiwork, but I'm still mechanical, not bioengineered like the fancy synths giving everyone the willies these days. I get tune-ups now instead of checkups. You remember when Dima was talking about the Institute's personality experiments? My memories. My personality. 
They're all lifted from some cop who volunteered for an experiment back before the war. Like Soma. They scanned That's his cool. brain and copied it onto the hardware that runs between Exactly the like ears. Soma. I don't know why they chose to make a robot based on some pre-war cop instead of a math genius or a bioengineer. But hey, maybe that's why the Institute tossed me in the garbage instead of turning me into one of their people snatchers. A shame, I think. You're a robot? Uh, can we can we say wait you're a robot what else have you been keeping from me huh. well I'm not sure if anyone told you but there's oh, no oh that's cute nothing big I think we'll bounce back just fine Nick you're becoming my favorite character I hope you know that wait the original Nick was from my time sure was which meant when I finally ended up out here, it was quite the rude awakening. I remember waking up one day in a garbage heap, a body in tatters and a head full of memories belonging to a man who'd been dead for 200 years. He lost the coin Suffice flip. I to say, it was a confusing couple of weeks. Folks didn't really know much about synths back then, so when I finally ran into people, they mostly treated me with caution rather than hostility. But the kids, <laughs> they weren't afraid. I think his name was Jim. The first person to actually speak to me after I got the boot from the Institute. My first human contact in this world. Grilled me for an hour. <laughs> Once they'd seen I wasn't going to hurt anyone, the other folks in the neighborhood came out to ogle the mechanical man. It eventually turned into a pretty swell soiree. The local mechanic even gave me a once-over, free of charge. Those people, they treated me like a human being. I've been trying to return the favor ever since. It's a surprisingly rare trait out here sometimes. And it's something I've noticed you got a fondness for. Part of the reason I've stuck around this long. Huh. Where's that town? We should go visit. I tried to go back and say thanks once I'd gotten myself established. But the place was wiped off the map. Raiders. Don't know what happened to the people. I do what's needed. Well, you certainly seem to judge doing good pretty high on your list of necessities. Well, More I happen you're about as bored really. as can be listening to me rattle my skeletons. We should probably head out. This is like the Nick DLC. It's like uh, the Isle of Madness for Sheogorath. The best character in Oblivion. That's pretty great. I enjoy that. I wish there was more of that. It's just so hard to get your companion. You have to dick around so long to get your companions to like you. I think... I'm pretty sure this psycho addiction... It, no? Why am I losing strength? Because psycho doesn't give you strength. Why is my carrying weight getting screwed up? Uh, I don't want to do a mysterious serum. Refreshing beverage. Huh. Weird. I wonder what was lowering my strength. Has to be the psycho addiction. Oh yeah, I wanted to see what this was too. Probably just another settlement. I'm glad we got to have that little talk with Nick. That's ah, fine, Nick. I am also mostly made of metal at this point. And all the bullets I've been shot with. Well, that's neat. That's a good uh, shore effect. Ugh. Can I get up this bastard clank? Oh shit. Let's say that's a Yagwai. Let's say, are you also not hostile for reasons? No, oh, you're hostile. Bad, Mr. Bear. 
break a sweat. Not that it's an option. Is there going to be porridge nearby? <laughs> Game does love its teddy bears. Is this the thing? This is not the thing. Where's the thing? It says there's a thing. Oh, there it is. Again. <coughs> nope, trappers. I think I'd rather fight super mutants. Piss on these guys. Oh, please don't. Please don't hit me with the boat hook. No, I'm inside the building, stupid. Where the hell are you at? Oh. You have a box on your head. Oh, that's Nicky boy. What do you have? Jangles the moon monkey. A jet, you say? Radix, more jet, even better. Where? Oh, there he is. More double barrel shotguns with these guys. What in God's name? I guess a whale. A little boat. people pieces. There were bodies in here. Oh, I wanted to take the hat and give it to Nick. Where those assholes go? Oh, they're in here. I didn't realize it was a different building. Anything else in here? Stimpak. Lovely. A lot of fishing rods. It's like a theme or something. Look at that asshole with the... Oh, where are you? No, oh, you're not a thing. What the hell are those? Oh. Buoys. Buoy markers. Pole hook. Blah. Okay. There's something else out here. Oh yeah, the ghouls are out here. So if we head to this swamp, and there's a hotel, that might be a quest. A hospital, a settlement, being anglers. <laughs> I'm smarter than your average bear game. I know where your damn anglers are. Boy, he's pissed too. I don't even think I hit him. Is that the medical facility? Hospital, could be a blood bank, could be a sanitarium. It's starting to look like a sanitarium. Pretty spiky sanitarium. Super mutants. Super mutants. What the? That's a solved problem. That's what that is, Nick. Out. I don't know if I want to dick the super mutants. God, I love combat rifles. It's 
taken a tremendous amount of willpower to not use one so far in the game. They're just throwing the ammo at me. I'm obligated to at this point. This isn't even tweaked. I'm sure it could be done better. Alder Sea Day Spa. Nah. Not feeling it. We can come back to it. Another settlement. Chickens? What the fuck is there a chicken doing out here? Rad chicken. I mean, I'm obligated. God, I hope there's a giant one at some point. Huh. Wouldn't want it going to waste now, would we? No shit, Nick. I haven't had fried chicken in 200 years. We need to find a cookerator. Or an air fryer. I suppose we could just take it to one of those hot spot rad zones. What's this? Is this what I'm looking for? More what fucking super mutants. National Park HQ. <laughs> I understand they're gonna Where's splatter my brains. Power? No. I'm gonna shoot lightning at you instead. You pricks. Oh boy, that's gonna hurt. And it won't be you! <laughs> oh god. He took a lot of uh, area of effect damage. Where's the other one at? Upstairs. This is no game, human! <laughs> no, it, it really does, Nick. Oh no, don't, don't abort critical. He has like no hit points left. Further east. I didn't get blown up by a suicider. Shame, I was hoping I'd be able to read that. The hell is this? Car plant? It's a nice car. Oh, it's the hotel. Hurt like a bastard. Viable blood sample. Nice. So there's some upstairs. Hack? No. Uh, anything useful? Visitor 
check in. Yeah, it didn't work. Premier visitor instructions. Uh-huh. Uh-huh. Oh. National Park. The observatory. The day spa. And the pop habit that adds things to my map. Hello. Shit. Enemy load. That was a lot of fucking rads. Well, that's neat. <laughs> Be vigilant. Communism is coming. Nice. Hey, some fusion cells. And a whole shitload of money. Picture frames in this DLC. So where are the stairs at? Are they outside? Not an elevator. That might work. Shitters. Nope. Boy, I'm tired of withered ones. And that damn leap attack. Get up then. Where does water come from? Ah, there we go. Military duct tape. This is a cool map. Yep, that's the way up. Reminds me of the ocean house a bit. Oh, Christ. Well, that said landmines. Oh, no. Damn, that hurts. Sorry, folks won't be chewing on us. About to level up. You playing hide and seek? Here you go. Nick? Sorry about that. So, how do we get in here? Oh no, that's just the swamp. Uh, 
there's just nothing else up here. damn jump attack. It's like the bastards in uh, Resident Evil 6. Just looking for the boss chest. That's all I want. That's more stairs. We found a part of the hotel you can't get to otherwise. Yeah, I know. I know you're alive. Troubleshooter's Revolutionary Sword. Oh, it's for robots. Where'd you go? Oh, fuck. <laughs> Damn it! God. Nope. I am unhappy about that. Where the hell did he go? Oh, God. Oh, no, that's a little one. Not super concerned about the little one. Ant. Yep. Well, at least I shot his arms off. That's a new one. That's neat. Where in the name of God are we? Are we back at the beginning? Trying to figure out the point of this place, other than just draining all your resources. Oh, there's an elevator. Hey, y you mind keeping an eye out for a second? You gotta run a diagnostic. It's because you keep letting us get chewed on by shit, Nick. Anyway, we'll finish this out and do that quest and go back to town next time!